Around, around. Around. Okay. 31st January 2019. This is the 12 years old female Pomeranian. Okay, the complaint from the owner is a lot of bleeding. There's a complaint. How long was the bleeding? Yesterday. A lot In of the bleeding. morning, I saw it's drop, drop, drop. And then mm. maybe she, and then she, she didn't eat since morning. Mm. And then. I thought, yeah, I thought partner. it's just a uh, period and then mm. she sleep in my room and then mm. also vomited this morning Maybe vomiting, she's sleeping yeah. the mm. thing, I don't know last night, right? Okay. So, and then of course I'm busy cleaning the bed and then I came back to my room to check her, maybe she wants to eat mm. I was, <laughs> of <yeah>. course <laughs> yeah, this is And I saw that, that's not normal anymore so It's not normal, the, the blood is very dirty, dirty brown blood, yeah, it's, it's pasta It's something like it's pasta. Yeah. And uh, so, when was the last hit? The period was two months ago. I was no, no, no. I think a one and a half months. I, I couldn't remember, but it's still a long time ago. No, I couldn't remember it. When but okay, when was the, the previous one? I mean, every, every year, every year, which month the dog has the period? Every year, I didn't record it as well. As long as I can see, some, it's just a few drops, right? So, because that's a, normal one, yeah, right? just a normal one. Because I didn't remember when it's it. Could it be it, near Christmas? I mean, in the past years. Yeah, it's the past year there is maybe near just Christmas put, time. Yeah, just put it somewhere there. Ah, so, so from what I can see here, is that normally the heat period is one to two months before the pyometra. This is called pyometra. Pyometra means infection of the, of the womb. Now, this infection of the womb happens differently from the heat period. The heat period is where the dog passes fresh blood. Normally, this when this infection comes in is normally one and a half months to two months at the end of the of the normal heat. Now, that's I ask her, so December, which is around Christmas time, Christmas time or around that month. Uh, oh, maybe before that, something uh, like that. But yeah, I couldn't roughly, remember roughly, roughly like that. So now is uh, January. So. So, but anyway, this is not a normal yeah, uh, heat. Huh? So, it's an instant diagnosis of open palmetra. Now, so what's the treatment? So, the treatment, there's only one treatment that is to remove the uterus, huh? which is full of pus. So, if you don't remove it, then uh, it will be toxic. The pus will be toxic to this whole dog. Then the dog will die from toxemia or septicemia. So, in, in this situation, it's not, pos not possible to give antibiotics anymore because there's too much infection coming out. So at the most, we have to give an IV drip and antibiotics inside and then uh, quickly operate because the dog is already vomiting. Vomiting how many times? Twice. Twice, how many days? No, just two days. Uh, just two days. So, yeah. the, so this shows that the owner has spotted the the infection early in the sense of earlier and uh, and the chances of recovery from hmm? it's uh, no and the chance of recovery from, from uh, anesthesia is good because uh, owner didn't delay long I'm talking about generally uh, I'm not talking about this long. Okay let's check the heart first. Diabetic no? mm. Any injection? Yeah. yeah insulin. Any diabetic the, uh, insulin injection? Yeah, she's having insulin twice a day. Twice a day, yeah? yeah. How many units? It's point one. Point one, two times a day. Mm, but still the sugar is the same size. Is the dog very thirsty or No, it's not like that. But the sugar is still no, but is the dog very hungry? No. Thirsty? No. She no. drink, it's, it's not like before she drink a lot. No, that, not this time it's normal. The, the, I mean, drink water and then the food is the same. So not hungry and thirsty, right? Not really. So in that sense, the diabetes is better controlled by the insulin. But it's not controlled. Yeah, it's not, not hundred percent control. The sugar, the, the glucose, is it urine glucose? Yeah, checking, yeah, yeah. checking the urine glucose, yeah. which is still high. Right? Mm -hmm. But anyway, uh, so it's up to the owner to take the risk because the dog is diabetic uh, and there's a risk of course during the anesthesia the dog may pass away. So you wait for the owner to come. Uh, so okay. when you're going to operate how much the cost? 
the man, I will ask the owner first whether he wants to do it because it's the, the problem is if you don't do it, then uh, this discharge will keep on coming for the next few days. Uh. This is uh, my experience with another old dog. Last time, last month, I had a golden retriever. So I put it here for the IV drip because the dog was very weak. Uh, much weaker than this. I'm uh, not eating. It's not eating, no? No, this morning today. Uh, oh, yesterday? Yes. Uh, so, uh, so the golden retriever was very bad with a uh, pass coming out. And uh, after three days of IV drips, then we operated on, on, on her. And uh, it's okay now, I mean, but uh, the thing is, we don't operate, then you can't see this dirty discharge coming out uh, every day. And the owner has to wash it, uh, the the dog, wash the back area. So, of course it's risky, definitely it's risky, but I can see the temperature is okay, 38.5. Huh? Okay, so the temperature yeah, no, no. yeah, it's not high, it's not high fever or it's not low. So, uh, check the heart is okay, lungs are okay, but uh, of course every, every old dog there's a risk there compared to a young dog, so we'll talk to the owner first. Huh? Mm -hmm. Because he's already off, definitely she can recover. Can recover? Can. If antibiotics, he might recover after some time of bleeding. Huh? But the problem is, reverse. The problem is, after that, next cycle it comes back again. The same uh, discharge again, bleeding. Again. I mean, Even more lecturers inside? No, I mean, if he did operate, if he did operate, he just give antibiotics. Huh? Mm -hmm. Because you're worried about the dog being over. Then uh, some dogs do recover on antibiotics. They need to no more discharge. But unfortunately, the next cycle, that means six months later, the whole thing comes back again, and and so it might become worse because the dog is older. Okay, so.